The least common use of constraint induced movement in therapy is in A. Stroke B. Duchenne muscular dystrophy C. Cerebral palsy D. Traumatic brain injury And the answer is D. Traumatic brain injury Explanation for this question is, the least common use of constraint induced movement therapy is for traumatic brain injury. CIMT is most commonly used for conditions like stroke and cerebral palsy to improve motor function by constraining the less impaired limb. While it has shown some benefits for TBI, the effects are more variable since each TBI can impact the brain differently. Conditions like stroke and CP tend to cause more localized impairments, making CIMT a more targeted and effective therapy. Duchenne muscular dystrophy also doesn't directly impact the brain or motor control centers, so CIMT would not be a standard treatment approach.